So this is basically a continuation of the other movie I did. So what you have is Pro Tools HD uh, launching here on a MacBook Pro with the HD license on the iLock. And you can see from the screen it's uh, launching the full HD 10 software. So you can definitely tell it's Pro Tools HD by the uh, using 10.81. There's the HD splash screen. You can also confirm it by seeing that you have BCA tracks. etc. All right. So now we'll just quit Pro Tools. And we're going to swap out iLock keys. Change the iLock. And now when we launch Pro Tools, we have the non-HD version of Pro Tools. So, one installation Two different iLock licenses that determines what license version of Pro Tools will run on the system. Alright, thanks.